And we just learned that 10 year old Raquel Rossetti is now brain dead. She and another little girl were walking in Tierra Santa over the weekend when a driver slammed into them. 10 News reporter Riel Creighton was in court for her arraignment where dozens of the victim's family saw her for the first time. Riel. Yeah, so many, Stephen Kim, uh, they weren't actually all able to fit inside the courtroom. Nearly 50 people showed up, all of them holding this same picture of the 10 year old little Raquel Rossetti. Many of them just finding out today, including the woman accused of hitting her, that the little girl is brain dead. Julianne Little in court to answer charges of hit and run and to her surprise, vehicular manslaughter. Says her attorney, this is her finding out for the first time the 10 year old she's accused of hitting with her car died. I am going to miss my baby sister, my only sister. Dozens of family members of 10 year old Raquel Rossetti showed up with stickers, posters and pictures to Little's arraignment minutes after it was over, offering up a message of forgiveness and understanding. And I know everyone expects me to be angry, but I'm not angry. Everyone makes mistakes. This mistake is just unfortunately irreversible. Little's other alleged victim, 12 year old Michaela Lee, still in a wheelchair with a fractured ankle, was also there in support. Her best friend, Raquel, says family, took the brunt of the impact. The prosecutor, arguing for a million dollar bail, said that Little Saturday was on Santo Road when she veered onto the sidewalk where 12 year old Michaela and 10 year old Raquel were walking. Raquel carried 60 feet on the hood of the car before being ejected into a bush. Little fled, says the DA, taking more than 20 minutes to return to the scene after lying about it to her family. She told her father she didn't know what she hit. She told her mother that she believed she hit a brick wall. Outside court, Little's defense attorney says she had no record, not even a traffic ticket, and is beyond devastated. There's a real possibility what we're talking about. Somebody here is a really good person who just had a really bad night. A 10 year old Ra Raquel was declared brain dead on Tuesday. Her family did not want to say today whether or not she remained on life support. Meantime, originally the woman who is accused of hitting her, Julianne Little, was arrested on a DUI charge at the scene. A charge has now been dropped. We're live outside the courthouse tonight. Riel Creighton, 10 News. Certainly more than just a bad night. All right, thank you, Riel.